Hey. Hey, tell us about this. Tell us about that. I heard myself. I'm aware. <laughs> We're currently at a campground without sewer. So I had to empty the gray into the portable thing. Yeah. And the portable thing is heavy. Uh -huh. And so when I lifted it onto the ball hitch on the back of the truck, I tweaked my back. And so now I can barely move. He's in traction now. <laughs> and the thing was cracked. The little toe thing was cracked. I don't know how it's cracked. And so it was leaking water all over the place. So I had to duct tape it. Yeah, redneck that up. So it wouldn't leak. Yeah. And I had to make two trips because we had so much gray water. And yeah. I took my back on the first trip. So I had to just suck it up. And now that I'm hurt, <laughs> I got to keep moving or else it'll tighten up. Yeah. So we're going to go and walk around the park. Yeah. There's some waterfalls around here. Supposedly. We'll see. I'm trying to keep positive attitude. <laughs> you can't do it. You can't do it. <laughs> it hurts. I know. And Leslie's going to drive. <sighs> Which is, I think, more painful for him to hand me the car keys than to deal with the back pain. He's not a good passenger. <laughs> I'm not a big uh, passenger. No. Not big on passengering. No, you're not. What is it called when you're actively passenging? <laughs> is that passengering? Sure. And this guy in front of us is not a good driver. No, he's just doing the speed limit. <laughs> well, we don't have time for that. No, uh, no. No, because we got. My back is hurting. <laughs> and see, this is why I'm not a good passenger because. Leslie waits until she's 12 inches away from someone to start breaking. <laughs> Why don't you take a nap or something? I can't. Just, My back hurts. <laughs> it's just reclined back. I'll never get back up. It's motorized. You'll just be hiking by yourself, man. Hi. Hi. You gonna get out? Yeah. yeah. I'm not. I'm facing I'm myself. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't help that these ginormous trucks are uh, so high up. Oh, I just oh, I did something. Lock I'm locking the doors. <laughs> doors and stuff. Oh, it's right here, man. It's like right there, mm -hmm. and then it shoots down my uh, right there down my ass into my leg. <laughs> All the way down your ass. It huh? shoots me in the ass. Yeah. Alrighty. Let's walk it off. Walk it off, man. Drink some water. Rub some dirt on it. Drink water. Could rub some dirt on it. <laughs> I think I hear water. Yeah? Yeah, I think I hear running water. <laughs> we gonna do this today? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Creepy, Bill. Yeah, that stopped me right in my track. I was wondering why you just stopped. I stopped because uh, I'm leading and that was not cool. Yeah, let me show you. I don't know if you can see it. There's a figure right there. That statue just standing right there. Statue. Freak me out. That is creepy. Oh my. Oh my. We have, we have things out. We have things out. <laughs> I see a <I'm> hip. <laughs> I don't know if this is allowed on YouTube or not. 
very interesting. I wonder what the point of this is. There's, there's no a, placard or no. anything. No explanation. It's definitely a little colder down here. <laughs> you can tell the temperature has dropped. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> Let's go to the mall. Okay. <laughs> You didn't tell me we were going on a Brazen Brits hike. <laughs> this is good for your back. <laughs> it doesn't feel good for my back. You'll thank me later. <laughs> okay. Well, now we're at Blue Hole Falls. Yeah. Supposedly there are three different waterfalls here. Hopefully they're easy to get to. And hopefully they're big enough that they're worth even seeing. Yeah. Because it didn't tell you what size they are. Mm. It didn't tell you how far you had to walk to get to them. That sucks. So we're about to find out. Enjoy. But hey, I guess I need to... I need to stretch my back out anyway, so. That's right. Yeah. Aw, that was pretty. Birds just singing, having a good day. <laughs> that just makes you feel better, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Much better. Well, apparently this used to be an old Indian ceremonial site. Yeah. Not like a fort fort like you no, would traditionally think of. No, the fort word is misleading because they, they didn't live with inside the walls. And they have a museum. Yeah. So we'll take you through the museum real fast. Hey. Hey, tell us about this. Tell us about that. Want me to tell you about their nuts? Yes, tell me about these nuts. <laughs> <laughs> what do you know about these nuts? <laughs> about these nuts. <laughs> That's it. That's the museum. All I got out of it was nuts. I know that's all you got out of it. <laughs> there was some other history. It was artifact stuff, stuff in there. And archaeological digging stuff. Cool stuff. Let's go see the falls. Oh, okay. Oh, I found the first fall. Yeah. It's supposed to be two more. I think it's tears. Yeah, it looks like it falls off over there, so we'll go check that out. But man, this is some ter terrain. Yeah, there's no distinct path, unless that main path takes you down to the very bottom that you said you should not do. Remember that? I feel like you're making this my fault. I just, I just, I just say. <laughs> Maybe that took you straight to the bottom. I thought, I we were not, I thought we were not pointing fingers and stuff. I'm an injured person. I have a back injury. Hard to concentrate. Anywho, I think though the best way to go is walking the terrain down. Because I don't necessarily think you'll see all three if you took the main path. So. Well, that's number one. Yeah. Let's see if we can find number two and number three. Without busting our butt in the book. If I go down down here, you have to carry me out. Negative. <laughs> <laughs> Stone. Why'd they need 50 acres? I don't know that they need 50 acres. It's just For 50 a ceremonial acres site. Like, that's... Yeah, and when we're on our way up here, let's go ceremonies. Like, sacrifices? I'm like, well, you know, like, weddings and stuff like that are ceremonies, Funerals. too. Funerals. Go 
See, she always goes to the dark side. <laughs> Sacrifices and funerals. I'm talking about how happy ceremonies. There's like birthdays, uh, weddings. Sacrifices, sacrifices and funerals. <laughs> It's a 50 acre thing. You can walk all it's the way an around it. Enclosed 50 acres. We're not going to do it. And they're so can. vague on there because they're saying even archaeologists are having to interpret what ceremony activities happen, but they don't say on the plaque what they think happened. So I'm like, they're being very vague. I think they might just not want you to know. Yeah. Which is why I say sacrifices and burials and stuff. So dark. <laughs> well, that's it for the waterfalls and for the Native American ceremonial site thing. Thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed you were, it. You were culturally enriched today, weren't you? Yeah, I yeah. learned stuff. Yeah. The museum was very interesting. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, stick Nobody around for... Nobody likes the smart ass. <laughs> It's true. Anyway, stick around for a few seconds. We're going to honor a fallen hero. If you want to get involved with helping us help veterans, everything you need to know is down in the description of the video. Yep. Appreciate you watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.